All right, Shalom. First off, and for most, as always, I want to say, call Lang La, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. Double honor be unto the elder apostles of Great Millstone that do rule and teach well. And of course, the sincere Shalom to Yankim out there, the hopeful elect that's pushing his word through the spirit, through the power, and through the name of Yahweh Bahashem Al Shai. Okay, so um, this lesson, you know, is going to be titled uh, Be Be Ye Not Unequally Yoked. It's like it be not unequally yoked, okay? Because um, us being this truth, you know, you realize that people, you know, that um, you realize you realize people, you know, all they want to talk about or do, you know, things that are of this world, things that are vanity, and you know, things that uh, in the on um, the long run are not gonna be uh, uh beneficial to our salvation, okay? But uh, without, without further ado. You know, I'm going uh, to start off with the scripture right here. Uh, 2 Corinthians 6 and 14, it says, Be ye not unequally yoked together with unbelievers. And why is that? Because first and foremost, you know, unbelievers don't have the same mindset as we do. Okay. You know, they're still in gross darkness. You know, they're still in the congregation of the dead. You know, so they're not on our level. Okay. They're still Gentiles. You know, as far as, you know, two, uh, Jake's, you know, that's in the world. Two thirds, you know, they're Gentiles, okay, and being uh, and the and um, uh, and on top of that, like it, like 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 it just said, they're unbelievers, you know. So you know, even though they're Israelites, you know, fellow Israelites, you know, they're not gonna, you know, uh, uh cleave, you know, to, to the to the things that you you know that you're about, you know, and that's why I stated early through the Spirit that we're you know not on the same level as uh, as the Israelites we see every day. As, as Jake, you know, that's still in the world. We're not, we're not on their level, man. We're above them. Not, not seeing that in a proud manner, but saying that spiritually, because Yahweh Shmuel Shai has, you know, opened up our our minds, man. Okay, we're on a spiritual, and a, 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 a higher level than than the, the uh, regular Israelite out here, man. All right, because like I said, all they want to talk about is things that's 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 others' world. You know, they want to partake in things that's others' world. But us, you know, we know we're uh, we're dead to this world, man. Okay, and and you know, and uh, being, you know, uh, around an unbeliever, you know, you can just tell that they're just all about vanity. Okay, and it says, "Be ye not unequally yoked together with unbelievers." Okay, and the word and that word yoked, all right, it means to join. All right, right here it says, uh, if you uh, scroll down, all right, it says to join. I got to highlight it right there. All right. So if you read it again, it says, be ye not unequally joined together with unbelievers. Okay. Because, you know, we, we're not going to be on the same page. Okay. The, the scriptures say in Amos 3 and 3 says, can two walk together lest they be agreed? And the answer is no. All right. How am I going to, you know, walk with you and be with you, you know, or vice versa if we can't agree on the same thing, if we're not on the same page. Okay. And it says, for what fellowship hath righteousness with unrighteousness? Right, man. Are you going to say Satanists, <laughs> you know, hanging around a Christian? You know, same thing with us. We're not going to be. Now, of course, brothers have family members. Of course, we live with, you know, hey, whatever you, uh, your, uh, your lot is, hey, that's cool. You know, but you're not going to catch us out, you know, every damn day hanging around, you know, two third Israelites. You know, you're not going to say, you know, uh, hanging around Pookie from the fucking corner. Okay, but hey, man, you got family. Hey, that's cool. But we're not gonna, you know, always be around our families. You know, you're not, you know, are not always gonna be around, you know, unbelievers. You know, if you get my gist. Okay, and it says, for what fellowship have righteousness with unrighteousness, and what communion have light? It's like it, and what and what communion, and what communion have light with darkness? Right, man, have light with darkness. Okay. Are you gonna see, you know, like I said earlier, you're gonna see a atheist or or, or, or Satanist with a Christian, you know? Same thing with us. You're not gonna see, you know, a a a a a, 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 a Muslim, you know, amongst amongst a a camp, okay? You're not gonna see, you know, a a a sinner, you know, a, a, a amongst somebody that, that that you know that's righteous, okay? You're not gonna see, you know, a gang of uh, uh, Edomites, you know, hanging around with a a, a a gang of Israelites, okay? It's not gonna happen because why? Because they're not yoked together, 
All right, they, you know they're they're different worlds, man. Okay, and going back to going back to what I was saying earlier, you know, you're not gonna be, you know, or hang around these these unbelievers, man. Okay, because first and foremost, they're of the world. We're not of the world, man. Okay, and all they want to go in about and talk about is things that's of this world. You know, either it's sports, either we're talking about getting that deep pop shot, you know, and and that's it. Okay, I came thinking more things that people want to talk about, you know. Outside it, you know, uh, uh, outside this truth, whatever it is, doesn't matter, because whatever it is, whatever is not this truth, is not going to benefit me, for, you know, of, of for my salvation in the long run. Okay, anything that's that doesn't deal with this truth is a hey, that is is behind me, you know. Don't want to deal with it. Okay, this is the book of um. Let me see. Rock 13 and verse 9. Uh, let me see. Oh, verse 15. So, uh, Rock 13 and verse 15. And it says, Every beast loveth his like, and every man loveth his neighbor. All flesh consorteth according to kind, and a man will cleave to his like. Right, man? man a, a man will cleave to somebody, you know, that's like him. You know, being like-minded, you know. And, and, and the scriptures uh, speak about being like-minded, being on the same accord and the same page. Okay. People out here, hey man, we're not like-minded. We're not in the same wavelength, okay? We're not in the same uh, 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 mental level as people out here, man. The, the, you know, and, and vice versa with them. They're not in our same mental level, you know, because the, the Most High Yahweh Shema Shai has opened up our, you know, uh, um, our mind and our, um, our eyes and ears, all right, but left them, you know, sleep spiritually, and, you know, left them dead spiritually, okay? That's why we don't, you know, tell things, you know, that's of you how about that's of you how about small shy this truth you know you know uh you know unto the, the uh the, the average person out here you know because first and foremost the scriptures say it says that don't, don't uh, uh give your uh pearls in the swine and also the, the, the scriptures say don't speak your uh wisdom into the ears of fools man okay because because they're not going to take heed okay because people out here they're still in the valley of the shadow of death they're oblivious to what's going on they don't know that privacy is popping off right now they don't know that America's falling down, you know, slowly but surely. They don't know that that Yahweh Shai is about to return and make his, and make his grand uh, his his his, uh, his grand return. They don't know these things, man. They don't know that Esau Edom is about to be overthrown. They don't know these things, man. Okay, that's why you know we just get in and get out. That's why the, the scriptures say we uh, we use the world but don't abuse it. Okay, and it says um, what fellowship? Have the wolf with the lamb, so the sinner with the godly, right, man? What what uh, uh, what chameleon uh, uh, chameleon have light with darkness? You know, like I said earlier, you're not gonna see a bunch of uh, you know uh, Israelites hanging around with a bunch of you know uh, Jakes in the corner, man. All right, unless unless they niggas too, okay. But you're not gonna see the uh, Yahweh Shmuel Shai's prophets hang around a block with a, a you know a, a, with a bunch of uh, niggas that that, that sagging their pants, okay? I, I know uh, unless they're you know out there in the highways and byways preaching the word, and Jake just happened to be out there, okay? But that's the only time, okay? But besides that, you're never gonna see righteous men, or should I say you know a righteous Israelites hanging around you know wicked ass Israelites, uh, you know unless you're gonna have a wicked ass Israelites you know uh, uh the, you know that's you know around them in the area. Okay, okay, but besides that, you know, we don't hang around people in the world, man. We don't do that, man. Okay, now, you know, we may have, you know, family. We, we you know, we, we say hi and bye, but that's about it. You know, well, I'm speaking for myself first and foremost. You know, I have, you know, I have, you know, of course, mother and father, but, I, you know, I barely see them. We you know, of course, we talk to them, but we don't, you know, always be around them. You know, we have siblings, but we're not always around them. Okay, we you know we have friends outside the truth, but we're not always around them. Okay, because... They're not on our level, man. All right, they're not gonna stand it. They're not gonna, uh, you know, understand the things that we do. All right, they're not gonna, you know, uh, 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 understand the mission that we're on. You know, through a sprint part we have by Shmuel Shai. Okay, and this uh, keep going. It says, um, "What agreement is there between the hyena and a dog, and what peace between the rich and the poor?" And that's, and that's plain, man. Okay, so this whole these these verses basically talking about. You know, uh, uh, um, opposites. Okay, 
you know, because people say the opposite, you know, uh, uh, um, uh, uh, opposites attract, but really that's a, that's a contrary to popular belief. You know, opposites don't attract, you know. Now, of course, you know, you have a man and a woman, you know, that's one thing because, you know, the, the most high Yahweh Shemal Shai created man and woman to be, to be you know, uh, uh, to be together, okay, because, you know, that's the natural order, you know, but as far as people being like, you know, as far as them being on the same page and whatnot and, you know, the same wavelength, all right, that's true. But if you're not on the same page, if you're not on the same wavelength as, as somebody else, you're not going to come together, man. All right. So that whole BS thing about, you know, opposites attract, that's that's bullshit, man. OK. And, and, and being the truth, you want to be around like minded men as yourself. Okay, All right. You want to be around people that can, you know, uh, relate to you and understand what, you, what you're talking about, when, you know, and what you say, you know, when you say it to them. OK, because if you don't, people going to look at you like you're fucking crazy. All right. This is the book of, um, let me see, Philippians 2 and verse 1. And it says, if there be, if there be therefore any consolation, any Havashah Mashiach, if any comfort, if any comfort of love, if any fellowship of the spirit, if any bowels and mercies, fulfill ye my joy, that ye be like-minded, okay, like-minded, have the same love, being of one accord, of one of mine. And basically, basically, Paul is saying, hey, man, be like my, you know, towards one another, you know, be on the same page, you know, being 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 of this one doctrine. OK, you know, being of, uh, uh, you know, being of, of uh, uh, one accord, man, of uh, of one body. OK, because um, the scriptures say that there is a, a one faith, you know, uh, uh, what's that saying in the world? You know, one band, one sound. Hey, man, it's one faith, man, you know, one baptism, you know, one truth, okay? And people, you know, they're not going to understand, you know, uh, what you're a part in. That's why it's not wise to, you know, you know, uh, uh, be unequally yoked, be unequally yoked, yoked together with unbelievers because, you know, if you always, you know, you know, uh, uh, you know, around them and whatnot, and, and, and if you always, you know, uh, um, amongst them, you know, you, you, hey, man, you, you're going to feel, you know, like an outcast, you know, you, you're not going to fit in. All right. That's why how about Shema Shai, you know, has called us, you know, to have the brotherhood around us. So that way, you know, we can be around like minded men, you know, and, 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 and uh, within that being around like minded men, you know, we can all relate to one another. And we can all, you know, come together and be of uh, one accord, man. OK, because uh, uh, you tr try to tell Jake something, you know, that's in the world, you know, about the truth. You know, they, they you know, they gonna look at you like you got three heads, man. You know, and that's why he says, let me get it real quick. I said it earlier. This is um, Proverbs 23 and verse 9. It says, uh, speak not in the ears of a fool, for he will despise the wisdom of thy words. Right. Man? So if you speak, you know, in, you know, the ears of a, a Gentile Israelite, they, they're not going to understand what you're saying to them, man. OK. <laughs> and it says, for he will despise the words it's like it, for he will despise the wisdom of thy words. Right. Man? So, so he's going to. Just fan away, we know what you just said unto him. He's not going to take heed. He's not going to listen. All right, and that's what, and that's why he says, you know, uh, let him be fifty still. You know, because uh, eventually, you know, these niggas, excuse my, excuse my language, you know, these these uh, these Gentiles, the uh, Israelites, you know, they're not going to want to take heed, man. Okay, because why? Because they're they're uh, uh, the Yahweh Shmuel Shai has spiritually blinded their. Um, their um their eyes and spirit and spiritually shut their ears from from obtaining this truth, okay. And it says uh, one more time, uh, Proverbs twenty three and nine says, "Speak not in the ears of a fool." And Jake, they're they're fools, man. You know they're sad as children. And it says, "For he will despise the wisdom of thy words." All right. And then the scriptures say, you know, hey man, you you don't despise me, you despise the one that sent me. Okay, so really, you know them. Despising uh, your words, you know, is, is really the words of Yahweh Bashma Shai, you know, because because this is Yahweh Bashma Shai's doctrine, you know, but but through but through uh, Yahweh Bashma Shai using men like the apostles and elders and down, you know, uh, uh, it's become the apostles' doctrine, you know, and you can read that in the Book of Acts, the second chapter, okay. <laughs> Real quickly. Uh we can end off on this.
This is Romans 12 and 16. It says, be of the same mind one toward another. Mind not hide things, but but conde condescend to men of low estate. Be not wise in your own consents. But the point once again, it says, be of the same mind one toward another. All right. Being 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 equally yoked together and not unequ and not unequally yoked together. OK, because, you know, being around an unbeliever, you know, they're not going to understand you. All right. And vice versa with them. OK, because our, because everything that they want to deal with and talk about is vain. It's vanity, man. All right. It's, 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 it's complete BS. All right. But if you're but if you're around men, you know, or other Israelites that, you know, that are uh, part of the ministry, you know, hey, man. It's gonna be a beautiful thing, man. All right, it's gonna be a, a, a beautiful thing, you know, to uh, to break bread with you know with other uh, uh, fellow brothers, you know, that are, that are um, part of the same thing that you know that you're in. Okay. So that being said, I want to say call Lam La Yahweh Bashem Al Shai Bashem Rachak Wadash until until uh, next lesson. Knock him, I say Shalom.